guys. So today I'm making another dollar store video or er, video. Yeah, dollar store video for a second. I got confusing because I said video and I thought immediately of like family video and like Blockbuster. <sighs> Took me back. Anyway, for this YouTube video, because I swear I live in the present. I am going to be opening and giving you the first impressions of some dollar store products. So these are from the family dollar. It just, there's a new one that opened up down the street from my house. Oh, and I went there specifically looking for this. This is the LA Colors, not to be confused with LA Girl, strobing illuminating powder. I've seen this online in a few first impressions and people are comparing it to like the Rihanna Fenty highlighter and I was like what for three dollars like yes I've got to find this and I figured since the family dollar down the street was like brand new I was like mm, grand opening like they're gonna have all their makeup right and they totally did actually it was a, a super win so I got this and then of course since I have no Salford Street I also got two blushes. This color is awesome. And this color is called As If. This one's like really a taupey mauve and this one's like a classic pink. Uh, I've actually seen these swatched online too. People said that they're a little bit pale but I kind of like that because my Wet n Wild blush is almost like a bit much sometimes. And I also got two of these lip glosses because these are a dollar. Oh, the blush is also three dollars. The blush is three dollars. The highlighter is three dollars. And then these are a dollar. This one's kind of like a pearlescent white, which is really pretty. And then this one's just a clear, just because I feel like I put clear over lipstick a lot, so the brush gets dirty. And once it gets like gunky, I mean, for a dollar, you can just throw it away. So I like to use those clear ones. Um, let me grab some brushes and we'll put these things on my face and see how they really look. Okay, I grabbed some brushes. I'm gonna start with the awesome shade. <laughs> That's what it's called, like literally. Let's see if I can get it open. Ah. This is the mauve taupey one. It comes with a brush, but I'm definitely not going to use it. And a mirror. So, opens like this. There's your blush. This little thing's on a hook. You got a little mirror. A little brush. Mirror isn't bad. I just, the brush is like, whatever. I'm going to use my own brush. I'm gonna use this big round one. I'm gonna try and use this a little bit like a contour since I also wanna try the other blush. I'm gonna put them both on at the same time. This one isn't very pink though, so. And if it's light, I might be able to get away with using both. Oh yeah, it's definitely light. But I can see it. Oh yeah. See, sometimes I like to buy and expensive makeup because if it works the way I want it to it's like a win-win so yeah this is this is pretty great it's very neutral it's not a warm tone at all it's a cool tone for sure which I'm into yeah I could definitely use this as like a contouring shade I think because my skin is so pink like I'm kind of like a little pink mouse bull rat kind of hairless cat person. So. Anything that's like golden or brown is almost like a bit much on me. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I was going to contour my nose, but I think I might save that other, save that brush for the other color. Let's see if I can just build this up just a little bit more. Just for fun, just for science, just to see. Yeah, I super like this blush. Dang, I've just been on such a like winning streak with the Dollar Tree and Family Dollar. So yeah, it's light. It's very much it's buildable. This brush isn't great quality either. This is just a Elf cosmetics brush, but and that's the Topi Move. You can see it just a little, just a little tinge. I like it, I like it, especially for $3. Now I'm going to go get this pink one. Bright pink. This color is called As If. 
same setup, obviously, because it's still the same product. I'm going to take this brush from my Dollar Tree video that I just tried. I actually really like this one for brush. This brush for blush. Oh, one day I'll figure out how to say that. Just because it, like, really packs it on. Just a little higher. Kind of overlaps a little bit. I gotta save a little bit of room for highlight, too. This is gonna be, like, an uber glow Hawaii, kawaii look right here. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's definitely white. But it's also definitely pink. Mm, I think it might have applied a little bit better with that fluffy brush. Oh, no. Here it comes. It's pretty light, but once you start to get to, like, the second layer, the third layer, that's when you really start to see it. But. Oh, it's not too powdery in the container. It's not, like, there's not much fallout or anything like that. It's a pretty stiff formula, it seems like. Which is pretty classic for inexpensive beauty products but in this case if you're one of those people who like likes blush but maybe is pale as ghost like me so it always looks like you got smacked around uh you know maybe this is maybe this is good for you also if you're someone who likes to like pile makeup on and then at the end you're like oh no what have i done i put on too much like you can get blush like this then you can put three layers on and you'd be like yeah yeah looking good looking chill got a little rosy glow but, yeah, for my purposes, those are cool. They might not be for everyone. But also for $3, you know, you can try. Now here, oh wait, I'm going to put that off for just a second. I just got inspired. I'm actually going to take this taupey shade of blush and go back and see if I can contour my eyelid with it a little bit. Oh yeah, that's a little bit, a little bit. I've been really getting into the idea of using, um, using the same products in as many places on your face to kind of give you like a really unified, almost more monochromatic look. Especially when it comes to like these natural colors, because I don't necessarily always have time to put a lot of makeup on. So, like, if I can use one product, like, this kind of neutral, cool, mauve blush to, like, do multiple things on my face, that will save me a lot of time in the morning. So, a little bit, a little bit. Okay, okay. The moment we've all been waiting for. Let's try this strobing highlighter. Woo! Okay. So that's another double layer one, so there's the highlighter and the lid, and then it looks like underneath it there's this little sponge and a mirror. Not going to use that sponge. I do like the mirror. I'm going to use this little guy to do my highlighter, just because I like him so much. Let's see. There it is. Ooh, it actually looks really cute with the pink. Like this highlight with as if the blush, that's a good combo. Oh, holy crap. Like it's almost going to my nose and I didn't even rub it that far. Look at this. Let me just paint my face gold real quick. Dang. This is every bit as striking as, as it appeared online. So there it is, my $3 highlighter with my dollar store brush. Hello, glow.
I, I don't even know what to say about that. This is a great highlighter. If you ever find yourself in a family dollar, just check and see if they have this. I'm probably going to use this as a an eye topper, to be honest. But if I was doing a dramatic makeup look and I wanted a powder highlight, this looks like a liquid highlighter, but it's a powder. Peace to my heart. Well, can't really compete with that, but let's throw on this pearlescent lip gloss just for fun. Oh my gosh, this is hard to open. I'll come back after I open it because this could take me like 10 minutes. I suck at opening things. Okay, I opened the lip gloss. But while I was opening the lip gloss, I had a thought about this highlighter. I have an eyeshadow brush right here and I already did my crease a little bit with that taupey purple. Although, I'm super inspired. I'm gonna have to do a makeup video with only a couple dollar store items. I'm gonna put this on my freaking eyelid because this, this is probably what I'm really gonna be using this for, like, on the daily. Oh, yes. That is so shiny. This is like, so metallic gold, like a foily gold, but it's not too yellow, it's like a white gold. Oh, I like it. Okay, the lip gloss, because we know that highlighter is awesome. Yeah, the little doe foot applicator on this thing is not fabulous, but... It is thick and glossy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, lip gloss, lip gloss. So I think I'm gonna do, comment down below if you want me to do this because I think I'm gonna do it anyway. So I think I'm gonna do a five minute makeup tutorial using just this taupe blush from the dollar store and this highlighter from the dollar store and just a couple brushes and maybe like a one dollar eyeliner something really really simple like maybe the whole look could be like under ten dollars for sure but in the next video super happy with how this came out so glad you guys got to see this